pumps are running at full strength once again across southern Kelloland following a heavy rainstorm. While some areas only saw an inch or two, it's a different story in the Parkston area. Kelloland Sarah McDonald shows you the damage. Brady, Sammy, overnight and throughout the morning, parts of Armour saw nearly eight inches of rain, while parts of Parkston received about six inches of rain. I talked with people in both communities earlier today. People in Armour are dealing with flooded yards, basements, and roads after about eight inches was dumped on the small town. Last night, probably around that six o'clock time frame, we had a really good downpour to start it all, all, all out with. Thunder, lightning, you know, then just rained all night long. Armour resident Riley Herlicek is spending part of his day helping get people and their belongings out of an apartment complex. This morning, got up at seven, looked out the backyard, and our fence was underwater. Uh, then went out to work for a little bit and came back into town and started unloading the apartments and hauled a bunch of boxes out. Herlicek isn't the only one. Several other people in town joined in to help. The whole community came together, just get an assembly line of boxes and just bring it all down. The town of Parkston also saw some flooding in the area. It's all through town, kind of. Uh, there's the creek is really never this this high and uh, as you can see yeah, it's, a, it's getting in people's yards and houses and stuff and coming over the roads. Residents here in Parkston say they received about five to six inches of rain last night. Surprisingly in the middle of July we have this much rain so uh, usually it's pretty dry and but yeah it's, we've been fortunate but a nice calm rain would be nice more than flash flooding. For a look at rain totals in your area we provided a link under this story on Killaland.com. Thanks Sarah.